In geology, a terrace is a step-like landform. A terrace consists of a flat or gently sloping geomorphic surface, called a tread, that is typically bounded one side by a steeper ascending slope, which is called a riser, or scarp. The tread and the steeper descending slope together constitute the terrace. Terraces can also consist of a tread bounded on all sides by a descending riser or scarp. A narrow terrace is often called a bench. The sediments underlying the tread and riser of a terrace are also commonly, but incorrectly, called terraces, leading to confusion. Terraces are formed in various ways. Fluvial terraces Fluvial terraces are remnants of the former floodplain of a stream of river. They are formed by the downcutting of a river or stream channel into and the abandonment and lateral erosion of its former floodplain. The downcutting, abandonment, and lateral erosion of a former floodplain can be the result of either changes in sea level, local or regional tectonic uplift, changes in local or regional climate, changes the amount of sediment being carried by the river or stream, change in discharge of the river, or a complex mixture of these and other factors. The most common sources of the variations in rivers and streams that create fluvial terraces are vegetative, geomorphic, and hydrologic responses to climate. More recently, the direct modification of rivers and streams and their watersheds by cultural processes have resulted in the development of terraces along many rivers and streams. Came terraces Came terraces are formed on the side of a glacial valley and are the deposits of meltwater streams flowing between the ice and the adjacent valley side. Marine terraces A marine terrace represents the former shoreline of a sea or ocean. It can be formed by marine abrasion or erosion of materials comprising the shoreline. The accumulations of sediments in the shallow water to slightly emerged coastal environments. Or the bioconstruction by coral reefs and accumulation of reef materials in intertropical regions. The formation of a marine terrace follows this general process, a wave-cut platform must be carved into bedrock. Although this is the first step to the process for the formation of a marine terrace, not all wave-cut platforms will become a marine terrace. After the wave-cut platform is formed it must be removed from interaction with the high wave energy. This process happens by either change in sea level due to glacial interglacial cycles or tectonically rising land masses. When the wave-cut has been raised above sea level it is preserved. The terraces are most commonly preserved in flights along the coastline. Lacustrine terraces, a lake terrace represents the former shoreline of either a non-glacial, glacial, or proglacial lake. As in case of marine terraces, a lake terrace can be formed by either the abrasion or erosion of materials comprising the shoreline, the accumulations of sediments in the shallow water to slightly emerged environments, or some combination of these. Given the smaller size of lakes relative to the size of typical marine water bodies, lake terraces are overall significantly narrower and less well developed than marine terraces. However not all lake terraces are relic shorelines. In case of the lake terraces of ancient ice-walled lakes, some proglacial lakes, and alluvium dammed lakes, they often represent the relic bottom of these lakes. Finally, Glacial acustrine came terraces are either the relic deltas or bottoms of ancient ice marginal lakes. Structural terraces, in geomorphology, a structural terrace is a terrace created by the differential erosion of flat lying or nearly flat lying layered strata. The terrace results from preferential stripping by erosion of a layer of softer strata from an underlying layer of harder strata. The preferential removal of softer material exposes the flat surface of the underlying harder layer creating the tread of a structural terrace. Structural terraces are commonly paired and not always associated with river valleys. Travertine terraces A travertine terrace is formed when geothermally heated supersaturated alkaline waters emerge to the surface and form waterfalls of precipitated carbonates. References See also Parallel Roads of Glenroy, Landform, Macca, Raised Beach, Raised Shoreline, Terrace, Wave Cut Platform, External Links. Here is a good example of a river terrace, http www.geography uni alangen de glaraisia of a terraces near Kazbeki JPG.